Why? Why? channel and welcome to another video today as you can tell from the title I'm gonna be doing a little bag haul next is this clutch bag um, it's a pink one I've had this I think since my 18th birthday I've had this bag for a very long time it's even falling apart like the flower on this other side I don't know where it went <laughs> and I'm not even sure oh, okay oh, there's a 10 bob in here why why like i'm so over this building with constructing every fucking time anyway so this is the other bag i have used this i think i want to say twice okay because the day of my birthday when i was turning 18 i had this for my birthday lunch um and then I think one more other time that I really can't remember and that is all that I've used that bag for. Anyway, so the next one, which is part of my bizarre bag collection, is this <laughs> ice cream bag. It's literally an ice cream bag. Um, it's a party favorite if you're going for like, I don't know, I don't know, you're going for like a fun afternoon birthday or something or anything interestingly cute you can easily use this bag the next bag i just threw them on the floor like because it's the only way i could do it the next bag this is not part of the bizarre bag collection but it looks bizarre-ish um this is a what the hell do you call this bag it kind of looks like some people have asked me if it's a shark cup, I just think I'm carrying underwear on my hand. Like, I'm not that crazy, but this looks so good for like a brunch or like a nice high tea thingy. Um, if only I had friends to do all that with. <laughs> anyway, so uh, my mom got this bag for me from Mango, yes. We got this from Mango, I don't remember how much it was. So. Yeah, I'm not even sure if Mango still has it. I don't think they repeat when they bring something, but you might check. You can check. Maybe it's still there. So, yeah, I got this from Mango. Well, not me. <laughs> My mom bought this for me from Mango. Um, the next bag, y'all, which is part of my Bizarre Bag Collection. I think the next couple of bags are from the Bizarre Bag Collection. Anyway, so this is my movie director bag y'all y'all know my dream is to become a movie producer slash director my dream is to become a movie director producer producer director whatever both really and this bag is the th this bag is my heart like look at it it looks like that movie clip thing action y'all anyway so <laughs> I got this from AliExpress as well. And then next, you guys, is my oopsie. It's running away from me. The next bag is this. It's my caution bag. Like, y'all, <laughs> look at it. Like, I have very cute pieces. I have, oh, by the way, I have used this bag in so many occasions. Um, I'm gonna include photos if I can find of me wearing these bags. Most of them I have pictures with them, but not all of them, most. Anyway, this bag, y'all, I have used this a couple of times, but I like wearing black or dark colors underneath, and then I pair it with this bag, and then it stands out because it's the show of the outfit. I have used this a couple of times, but it has attachments, like there's a big strap that goes it wraps around it. I have never put it because I like carrying it like this. But I think I'm just gonna like add this one day because I think, you know, maybe it's gonna look cute with the strap and the stuff. So the next bag, y'all, is this beauty. Oh my God, I have used this bag once for my birthday this year. Um, had a birthday dinner so this is what I wore for my 22nd birthday and I got this from Aliexpress nothing fits in this thing the only thing I had inside I think was my 
my bank my my bank card i had my id and my driver's license in here and then on top of it i had my car keys and that was it it couldn't fit anything else and i think a couple of like loose change because maybe i would have needed it for like tip or parking so yeah th that's all that can fit in this bag really i got this bag for five thousand and something from aliexpress as well if i find the stories you guys i swear i promise i'm gonna link them below for you guys because you deserve to know exactly where they come from the next bag that i'm gonna show you guys is my chocolate bag now this bag i have never used it ever since i got it uh, it still even has the packaging for the strap inside because i've never really used it um Eventually, I'm gonna start going for more dinners, more events, so I will start using these bags. But this is my uh, chocolate bag. How much I got this for? I think 4,500 or something. They all range around the same price, y'all. They're not. They all range around the between 4,000 and 7,000. That's why they range. So yeah, if I still resell this, I'll probably sell it at 10,000 because y'all. Um, the next bag is this cute piano bag y'all have i used this bag before no i haven't i have not used this bag but i think my mom has i might be confusing with another bag but i think she's used this bag before so yeah this is my piano bag and i am obsessed with it yes i've never used it but see how cute it is okay i think i need to get out more because look at all the stuff i have and nowhere to go <laughs> it's not sad it's just shocking so we have this bag i got this for i think i think 3800 something of the sort yeah i want to say around that around that price around that so we have that and the next i have this pink guitar bag um this is perfect for a high tea okay look at it look how pretty it is it has like the long every all these bags have the long um strap but i haven't installed it because i when i used it i never really used the strap so this is it the next thing guys is this radio bag like yum it's cute i think i've no i haven't seen this before um <laughs> I got this from Aliexpress as well. This is part, all the bags I've showed you from the producer bag is all from um, from the Bizarre Bag Collection. So it still has the strap inside. And I think, have I used, yeah, I've used this bag once. I've only used it one time. One time and one time only. I bought so many of these bags from Aliexpress. The next, maybe I should have shown you all the bizarre bag collection first before I go to any other. The next bizarre bag, uh, part of the bag collection is this lipstick bag, y'all. I have never used this bag at all because I have never had an occasion where I can use this bag. It's so high, it's so like, well, black tie. It is very fancy okay very fancy y'all like look at it i have never really found uh, uh any fans to go to with this bag so i'm gonna keep it until the i know there's an event one time that's gonna require me to take this bag but nothing can fit in here to be honest with you guys maybe just my ids and you know my ids and like yeah and a couple of loose changes the only thing that can fit in here true story so the next bag is this cute one. I have seen this bag around in Kenya a couple of times, but I got this bag from Aliexpress as well. Never used it, never used it at all. Um, it can fit a couple of stuff in here. Like if you really squeeze them, they're gonna fit. But the problem comes in when you have to squeeze it like this so you can be able to close it that's where the problem comes in so anyway this is just a statement piece really it's not a practical bag it's just a look at me um i look cool i look fancy i look expensive kind of bag uh, the next bag is this one my goodness this screams 
luxury i don't know what about this bag but i look at it and i'm like damn this is great y'all this is amazing um i got this from aliexpress as well yeah and i have never never used it i have never used it it still has the strap packed inside of it i've never used it never never that's what i'm telling you guys um i have so many cute pieces that i've never used when it comes to the time of using y'all are gonna be so done with me now the next bag on this collection or the i think yeah this is the last bag no it's not second last bag it's on my bizarre bag collection is this very classy very expensive very glamorous looking evening bag um this bag never used it of course i've never used it um let's see it doesn't have any other thing that comes with it it just has some extra diamonds just in case you lose one you have like extra diamonds to put on and that's all that's all there's nothing in here so this bag can easily fit a phone and some car like a wallet like a very skinny wallet but it's not gonna fit your car keys because it's a statement piece never use it y'all like i need to go to events or something so that i can be able to use this bag the last bag in this collection is my shirt bag uh, this bag i've used it a couple of times and people go crazy when they see that was like you know give it to me i give my daughter or give it to me i use it or stuff like that so i have this bag i've used it for a long time it fits a couple of things in here it can fit your phone your wallet and your car keys it can fit a bunch of stuff so it's very it's a little bit more practical than most of the bags that i have but yeah um, anyway we're done with the bizarre bag collection and now back to my other bags i have this red love hut bag this bag my mom got it for me i don't know how much honestly i don't know <laughs> and then i have this pink bag that i think i got from mr price if i'm not wrong i want to say i got this from mr price i might be wrong about that because i don't really remember but i have used this a couple of times a couple i've actually used this bag a lot uh see it's full of receipts because i've used it quite a lot so there's this one it's very cute very you know mm -hmm. it, i just i just look fancy carrying it yeah it can it can fit a quite a lot of stuff so it's quite practical and also very cute at the same time so yeah um and then the next bag that i have we're almost done with this haul y'all the next bag is this bag that my mom got for me in dubai that place i don't know how it's called y'all but it was a big uh, land with different countries showing off their different things that are found in their country so she got this and i remember this bag was tankery because when i told her to get this for me she looked at me and she's like this is gonna be our bag okay but mostly i use it and she forgot that she bought this to be our bag now it's just my bag so yeah and finally finally y'all I am going to finish this bag haul with this bag. Yo! <laughs> this bag, my mom, let me give you a little backstory before we start talking about it. My mom got me this bag and the matching shoes when I started my internship uh, last year. Yeah, last year, June, around June. She got me this as a present to, you know, go and, you know, into the work um environment you know slaying and being all confident even if that internship only lasted a month instead of three months but anyway this is my most expensive bag that i have in my closet it comes with matching pairs of shoe this is a christian dior bag my mom got this bag for me for i think twenty thousand or something and the matching shoes so she paid almost 40k for this uh 
<laughs> I was like, I can buy this for myself. I can afford it. I'm, I'm, I'm broke. I can buy it a twenty thousand nini a bag. But she did. So I have my Christian Dior bag. I have never had a designer bag except this one. Clothes and shoes. I've had a couple. I have Valentina. I have Louis V. I have Fendi. But a bag. Oh my goodness. This is my. This is my very fast designer bag and I'm not even I don't even use it that much but I don't destroy it but yeah I think we are done y'all okay that was a pretty haul about all the bags that I have I let me count let me count let me see how bags I have one two three four five six seven eight, seven eight, twelve twenty I have twenty here and the first round had let's see one two five that's 25 plus i think about 30 but oh i have around 30 bags and i haven't even counted my tote bag and my other looking bag anyway so that is all for my video today okay this is my weird little obsession that i didn't know i have but now looking at it i think i do but yeah anyway guys thank you so much for watching this video if you enjoyed this video please give me a thumbs up and comment down below what more you want to see on my channel and also if you're watching all the way till the end y'all need to just subscribe to my channel it means you like this you enjoy seeing my face so um go ahead and subscribe to my channel and join my family and with that guys i'm gonna see you in my next video goodbye she's a mona lisa everyone's lining up to see her she's a mona lisa everyone's lining up to see her